what are your members saying? The, the, the numbers are one thing, but I'm sure the reality you deal with is, is in many ways another. What's the feedback you're getting? Uh, good evening, Dr. John, and good evening to the 702 listeners. Indeed, uh, when, when you are a healthcare worker on the ground and you are listening to the Premier, uh, you know, narrating these numbers, you ask yourself, uh, because the situation that you are faced with says we are not even testing everyone. The resources are not allowing us to be able to be effective enough at even testing each and every person or taking everyone as a patient that is under investigation that walks inside the corridors of our clinics and our hospitals. And that speaks to resources. But also we are saying these numbers are, are worrisome because the, the, the six criteria of of testing even for COVID has been narrowed down so severely to just testing for those people who are presenting with symptoms and also testing those who are going for surgical procedure yes. and so forth. But we are not now on massive testing. We are no longer. So you ask yourself, these numbers that are going down, are they comparing them? What are they comparing them with? Or are we just saying that they're going down because we are testing less? So it makes you wonder because currently as we speak, Yes, uh, we are seeing, you know, less and less as as it becomes warmer. Uh, the season, you know, we are moving away from winter. You are see, seeing less um, persons presenting with uh, symptoms of COVID presenting in the hospitals. But we are still having hospitals that are full. Uh, we are still having lack of resources and the staff has not changed. So really, the dynamics that assist us to cope have not been picked up. And if you speak to nurses in different provinces, they'll, they'll give you the same narrative to say, look, we are sitting on 110 capacity. Uh, we are not even checking what the numbers are saying anymore because we know the reality. The reality is saying to us, uh, we are still not out of the woods as yet, yes. uh, but because it's getting warmer, we are getting out of out of winter, uh, we are starting to see less and less people presenting with symptoms. Yes. But it's still a worrisome factor because the focus is now more on vaccination and not on testing. So, so those numbers are really uh, problematic. News. Experts. Analysis. Where things stand. What you need to know. Drive home with John Pullman. On 702.